Welcome everyone to Lamar University, also known as Cardinal Nation. This Division I public university with Carnegie doctoral research status sits on a boom town of knowledge and serves a diverse group of more than 17,000 students. Uniquely positioned in the energy corridor of Beaumont, Texas, Lamar University excels in educating career-ready graduates who are future engineers, business owners, teachers, performers, researchers, and more. Approaching its centennial celebration, Lamar University has a story you will want to hear. I'm your host, Alex Boylan, and over the next half hour, we're gonna travel around this unique campus to meet real students going to Lamar University right now. We'll hear stories from aspiring doctors, lawyers, and even a musician. The passion these students have for Lamar University is contagious, and the commitment to student success from faculty and staff is unmatched. Welcome to Lamar University. This is the College Tour. Okay, everyone, let's head over to meet up with Elena. Elena is a senior from Houston, majoring in industrial engineering. Elena can't wait to tell us about Lamar University's connection to the local community and its rich history. Elena, we have questions and you have answers. Please take it away. Thank you so much, Alex. When I was a senior in high school, I wasn't sure where I wanted to attend college, but I knew I wanted to be an engineer and continue my dance career somewhere that felt like home. Lamar University and the Southeast Texas community is what makes my experience here so special. This campus is truly a boomtown of knowledge. Lamar has given me so many opportunities. From three years on the dance team, working as a campus tour guide, and studying industrial engineering, there is so much to be celebrated at Lamar University. The tight-knit community of friends, mentors, and professors is built on a long-standing tradition of excellence and collaborative partnerships. Lamar University has proudly served the Southeast Texas community now for 100 years. Beaumont earned its place on the map in 1901 when the Lucas Oil Gusher struck one of the largest underground sources of oil in the U.S. at the time. As Beaumont grew into a bustling community of families, education became a strong priority. In 1923, South Park Junior College was established. Over the years, the college transformed from Lamar College to Lamar State College of Technology, focusing on engineering and science. Its growth and reputation have continued hand in hand with numerous campus expansion and a flourishing, pride-filled student base. Uniquely positioned in the energy corridor of Texas, LU excels in educating future engineers, business owners, teachers, performers, and researchers just like myself. I'm so thankful I will be graduating from Lamar University with not only a bachelor's degree, but with excellence. I have gained so much experience here, where once they were producing oil, and now we are producing graduates to sustain a flourish throughout our communities. Back to you, Alex. Elena, that was awesome. It's so fun to hear about the collaborative environment that truly allows students to create lasting friendships and relationships with one another. Fostering these connections across the community really allows Lamar students to have an immersive campus experience. Thanks so much, Elena. Okay, everyone, it's time to meet a Houstonian turned Southeast Texan. Jay is a music major from Houston. He's excited to talk to us about the amazing experience being a transfer student and all the resources Lamar can offer, making that process easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Let's go, Jay. Thanks, Alex. Hi, everyone. My journey to becoming a Cardinal was a little non-traditional. I initially started college at a school in Louisiana, but I decided to transfer because I wanted a school that showcased the passion for fine arts and had a diverse student population. I chose Lamar because it was not too close to home and also not too far away. When I transferred to Lamar, I applied the conventional way and it was a seamless and easy transition throughout. I was able to schedule a tour through the Welcome Center where an LU crew member was able to show me resources across campus like the Financial Aid Office, the Undergraduate Advising Center, and everyone's favorite, the Setzer Student Center. Being a transfer student can sometimes make you feel like an outsider, but everyone at Lamar University has been kind and welcoming, which makes it easy to make new friends. 
One thing that helped ease the transition was getting involved on campus, like joining marching band, also known as the Showcase of Southeast Texas. One thing I've realized about college is that the connections you make can take you very far in life, and I'm very fortunate that I've met some great people here within the past few years. It also never hurts to go up to someone and say hi. You never know where it may lead. Being a transfer student wasn't originally part of my big plan, but it has since become the best decision I could have made. My time at Lamar has been an experience of a lifetime. I have made so many friends and connections that will last me forever. In the meantime, back to you, Alex. Awesome job, Jay. You're a great ambassador for Lamar. I love that Lamar University is working to recruit and retain more great students like you. And I can't wait to come back and visit and see all that you have accomplished. That was excellent. It's time to meet a Southeast Texas native. Emily is a freshman at Lamar majoring in history with the hopes of becoming a teacher. She is excited to talk to us about the amazing experience she has had living on campus and how it has made a positive impact on her overall college experience. Let's go, Emily. Thank you, Alex. What's up, everyone? As a kid, I always talked about becoming a teacher like it was a certainty in my future, and now I'm making my younger self proud by following my dreams here at Lamar University. Being able to live on campus, I've gotten to experience college life closer than ever by living in one of the residence halls in Carnal Village. By attending several events led by the resident assistants who live in my hall, I've gotten closer to my roommate and my neighbors. Living on campus, I often eat breakfast, lunch, and dinner at the Brook Shivers Dining Hall. The dining hall has become a place for me to hang out with friends or have family dinner with my brothers who also attend Lamar University. You definitely get the full college experience with places like Starbucks, Smoothie King, and everyone's favorite, Chick-fil-A. The resident halls feel like a second home to me. The communal rooms are so cozy and we even get our own bathroom to share with our roommate. Getting to sleep in my own bedroom has been amazing as well. Along with the events hosted by the Cardinal Village Residence Halls, we also have our own pool so you can cool down in these high Texas temperatures. Being able to live at Lamar has brought me so close to life on campus and I've been really enjoying all the dining options that are here as well. It allows me to stay connected with friends and really enjoy my time here at the residence halls. Well, that's all I've got. Back to you, Alex. Awesome job, Emily. You're a great ambassador for campus life. I love that there is such an at-home atmosphere here at Lamar and your dorm room was rocking. Thanks again, Emily, for sharing your space with us. Okay, now we have Alexis a senior majoring in communication broadcasting. She's gonna tell us about the thriving academic programs here at Lamar and how it has transformed her future. Let's hear it, Alexis. Thank you for that wonderful introduction, Alex. Now let's fly into my college journey. During my senior year of high school, I toured different colleges and universities but there was only one that felt like home, Lamar University. That's when I knew I wanted to be a Cardinal. Since attending Lamar University, I've made connections with city officials, met industry leaders, and worked with media professionals. I have been to conferences and workshops in Las Vegas, Baltimore, and New York. None of this would have been possible without being a part of a university that is affordable and accessible to a diverse student population. Lamar University has presented me with many academic opportunities to make the most of my time. I serve as the Vice President of the Lambda Pi Eta Honor Society, participate in Lamar University's television station, LUTV, as a multimedia journalist and intern for the Department of Communication and Media. I also earned a spot on the Dean's List multiple times throughout my college career. Being involved in so many things, I've learned to make the most of my time and use the resources Lamar University offers, like money management, which helped increase my financial knowledge and also allowed me to make informed financial decisions. One of the biggest blessings from this university was being selected for the Lamar Promise Program which students are eligible for based on certain criteria. When I got the call that I was selected for this program, I was thrilled. Because of this, I will graduate debt free. After graduating, I plan to spread my wings and work in the communication field, 
showing the world all that I have learned. The moments at Lamar University has made my college career unforgettable. That's it for my time. Back to you, Alex. Wow, Alexis, it is amazing learning how you were able to pursue your passion through the College of Fine Arts and Communications and being selected for the Lamar Promise Program. There really are no limits to what you can do right here at Lamar. Thanks, Alexis. We are now going to introduce you to Hannah, a senior majoring in biology and chemistry. Like many other students at Lamar, Hannah has a passion for STEM also known as science, technology, engineering, and math. And she's gonna to talk to us a bit about Lamar's commitment to the STEM learning environment. Hannah, take it away. Hello, Alex, and welcome everyone to Lamar University. I always wanted to be a doctor, and that meant completing a quality undergraduate STEM program. Growing up locally and having parents that graduated from Lamar University, I am confident in the education that I'm receiving here. As a presidential scholar and member of the Rio Honors College, I began my education with a built-in support system of peer and faculty mentors who encourage interactions among individuals with diverse backgrounds. I've combined my dedication to academic excellence, community involvement, and organizational leadership to create a productive college experience. Whether participating in projects benefiting those in need or promoting Lamar University's Women in STEM organization as a founding member, opportunities always arise for personal growth and development. I spent a lot of my time in Lamar's 83,000 square foot science and technology building. It supports classroom instruction, university research projects, and undergraduate STEM programs, encouraging collaboration and cutting edge operations amongst professors and students. The Makerspace area provides hands-on learning, allowing the production of product prototypes. On a personal note, I love the study rooms located here and I use them regularly. Lamar University is dedicated to all things STEM and remains one of the top producers of high achieving graduates from these assorted fields. From providing current students with influential internships to supporting diversity and minority involvement in STEM fields and to offering STEM summer outreach programs to the public, Lamar University's effect on our surrounding community and world is far reaching. Starting college is an exciting yet uncertain time for everybody. I found that Lamar University felt more like home than school. As I move forward to medical school upon graduation, I am certain that Lamar University's undergraduate program has prepared me with a strong foundation on which to grow. Thanks for stopping by. Alex, back to you. Thanks so much for sharing your experience with us, Hannah. I can't believe how many options there are for students that are interested in the STEM field. It sounds like you have taken full advantage of the college experience and that is what it's all about. Thanks again, Hannah. Okay, everyone, we're going to meet Antonio, who's gonna tell us how Lamar University has worked in recent years to become more diverse and to better support an inclusive atmosphere. Antonio, you are on. Thank you for that awesome introduction, Alex. And hi, everybody. I am originally from Guanajuato, Mexico, and came to this country in search of a top-tier education around 10 years ago. Lamar University checked out the box for me with its affordability, rigorous academics, and inclusive and diverse student body. As the first-generation high school graduate in my family, I was afraid the high cost of college would stop me from pursuing a higher education. But Lamar is amongst the top 10 most affordable colleges in Texas and still awards over 2,000 scholarships and provides more than $10 million in assistance to students. One of these scholarships is the Smith Hudson Scholarship, which I was honored to receive. This scholarship targets low-income, high-potential income freshmen and fully covers tuition, room and board, and books for all four years. After having seen my parents go through the immigration process, I knew I wanted to pursue a career in law. Lamar University has an award-winning MOOC core team a student-run competitive speech team, rigorous classes aimed at preparing students for law school, and a diverse group of advisors and professors that deeply care about your success. Before I even came to campus, Lamar University showed me its mission of serving and empowering minorities by giving me the opportunity to attend the Leadership Summit, 
along with other Hispanic and Black students. The summit aimed to engage students on college and career readiness, identity, and brotherhood. I honestly wouldn't want to be anywhere else other than surrounded by driven, diverse, and amicable Cardinals who want to see each other succeed. I am thrilled to see what these four years have in store for me here at Lamar University. I rest my case. Back to you, Alex. Antonio, it's incredible hearing the passion you bring to Lamar University, and we have no doubt you'll make a killer attorney. And thanks for telling us how Lamar University is working to become more inclusive of all students. Take care, Antonio. All right, let's meet Landon, a graduate student focusing on human resources leadership. He's going to tell us all about how easy it is for students to connect across campus and take advantage of a variety of resources. Landon, please take it away. Hey Alex, thanks for the introduction. I recently completed my BBA in Human Resource Management and minor in Communications. Now I'm working on my MBA with an emphasis in leadership. I've had so many amazing opportunities, such as having my own talk show called Connecting with Cardinals, being a Lamar University ambassador, as well as being heavily involved within the College of Business and throughout campus. However, I would not be the person I am today without the amazing resources Lamar University provides. Lamar University has phenomenal student resources for students who need extra support, such as student tutoring and retention services, better known as STARS around here, the Student Health Center, and the Center for Career and Professional Development. There is always someone here to help on campus. They're equipped to help every student in their unique goals, experiences, and situations. I've never had to wait in a wait list, which is very beneficial whenever I want to handle something quickly. Through STARS, I was introduced to a success coach and fellow student who provided the tools to accomplish my goals, and I was encouraged to connect with other resources across campus. Counseling at the Student Health Center can help provide you with the tools to have a healthy mindset and learn how to adjust between the stress and anxiety of being a full-time student. The Center for Career and Professional Development connects students with a career consultant specific to their major or college within the university. That really helped me build my resume and profile on LinkedIn. No matter your unique circumstances or experiences, the student resources are here to help you in your academic career. Lamar University cares about you as a student, professionally and personally. Well, that's all for me. Thank you for listening and back to you, Alex. Thank you, Landon. I loved hearing your story about how the resources on campus helped you along the way. How impressive is it that you received your undergrad here and are now working on your graduate? Lamar must really have made a positive impact on you, which is fantastic. Thanks again, Landon. All right, everyone, let's meet Jacob. He's a senior from Coons, and he's gonna tell us about campus life here at Lamar University, plus some of the clubs and projects he's part of on campus. Take it away, Jacob. Hi everyone. Going into college, I had no idea what to expect. I knew that I wanted to have the greatest college experience I could have, but I was really nervous about branching out and meeting new people. In high school, I was involved in band, so I decided to join the Showcase of Southeast Texas Marching Band. Not long into the football season, a few of my friends and I decided to apply to be orientation leaders. And just like that, I became an orientation leader, working for the Division of Student Engagement at Lamar University. After working as an orientation leader for one summer, I became a student orientation coordinator at Lamar University. While working in this position, I helped get other students engaged on campus by organizing and executing Lamar University's two week-long welcome events, Week of Welcome in the Fall and Welcome Back Week in the Spring. It was so much fun being able to coordinate events from petting zoos to silent discos to first-year games. I also learned very early on that Lamar is committed to student success. Classes are extremely important, but a true college experience combines the classroom experience with the relationships built in on-campus involvement and the things we learn off campus. This past summer, the Rio Honors College helped fund me and my friend to visit Alaska as part of the Partners in the Park program. While there, we were able to learn about the culture of people over 2,000 miles away from Lamar University. That's what I'm talking about, bringing what we're learning in the classroom to life. 
Thanks for listening as I share my story. I know you too can have the experience of a lifetime at Lamar University. Back to you, Alex. That is right, Jacob. Wow, you can really do just about anything here at Lamar. Jacob, thanks for telling us about student organizations here and showing us how easy it is to get involved in something you're passionate about on campus. Thanks, Jacob. Now we are introducing Stephanie. Stephanie is a junior majoring in psychology with a biology and chemistry minor and is also part of the Rio Honors College. Stephanie will tell us all about the opportunities there are for students to excel to the next level. Take it away, Stephanie. Hey guys, growing up 15 minutes away from Lamar University, I had always heard of it, but I didn't know all the amazing opportunities that it provided. The second I walked onto campus, I instantly felt welcomed and accepted, a feeling I knew I wouldn't get anywhere else. I came into Lamar University as a presidential scholar and a part of the Rio Honors College. The Honors College has almost 500 students enrolled, which is not surprising since it provides so many benefits. My first year here, I didn't know what I wanted to pursue, but I knew it was in healthcare. Thankfully, I was immersed with other honors students who helped me find my passion. As an honor student, I am provided student-focused professors and surrounded by multiple student organizations led by my peers. My first semester here, I became a founding officer of the new organization, Lamar University Hispanic Society, which was led by all honor students and still continues to grow on campus. Lamar University's Honors College ensures that each one of us has a path to success, offering multiple different pathways for your future plans and goals. Through the college's mentor program, which I help coordinate, I've had the opportunity to connect with multiple honors alumni that are more than committed to offer advice on personal and professional growth. By being a part of the Honors College, I have been able to meet so many ambitious students who help me push myself to become a better leader and person. The close-knit family atmosphere that you're able to create here at Lamar University is what I would say is impeccable. Well, that's all from me. Back to you, Alex. Great job, Stephanie, and thanks for sharing your own experience as a student of the Rio Honors College. Great job being a founding member of the Lamar Hispanic Society. It really sounds like the Honors College has given you a number of resources to be successful, and that is awesome. Thanks, Stephanie. All right, everyone, let's get ready for the one and only Zaid. Zaid is a junior from Beaumont majoring in biology with a minor in chemistry. He's gonna tell us about research, internships, and the resources that go along with supporting students through those opportunities. Zaid, the floor is all yours. I appreciate it, Alex. Hey everyone, I love Lamar University because it allows you to apply your studies into the real world with research and internship opportunities. Here, Many lecture classes also have a lab component where the small professor-student ratio allows for a more nurturing environment. For every class you take at Lamar, there will be a research or internship prospect that lets you delve deeper into your studies. After taking the stem cell seminar class, I became involved with the professor's research lab, which focuses on cancer and stem cells. A current project we're focusing on examines how microplastics affects wound healing. Lamar University also offers opportunities for off-campus learning. I spent a summer in Dallas at the Thermal and Vascular Physiology Lab. This past summer, I was honored to receive the Beck Fellowship at Lamar University, which awarded me a $10,000 stipend to travel to Canada to work on a project involving autophagy receptors in cancer cells. The Office of Undergraduate Research offers students, like myself, research stipends and grants, as well as many fellowship opportunities. There are also a variety of co-op opportunities for engineering students, career expos, and research conferences here at Lamar. Student organizations, such as the Lamar Undergraduate Research Association, of which I am president, seeks to encourage students of different labs to interact, share what they're working on, and to gain insights from their peers. Whatever topic you study at Lamar University, you won't just read about it in the textbook, but you'll also get experience doing it. With an abundance of opportunities and a tight-knit student community on campus, you'll never feel alone. I'm truly blessed to be a part of the LU family, to gain technical and communication skills, to be better prepared for the workforce, and to have fun. Back to you, Alex.
Wait, Zade, you're telling me that research isn't just someone in a lab coat doing science stuff, it's that and more? Wow, that is awesome that Lamar encourages and supports students to do research and internships of all kinds, no matter what year in school you're in. Thanks, Zade. All right, y'all, how awesome is Lamar University? I want to thank all these wonderful Southeast Texans for giving their time so that you can learn more about their school. I've really enjoyed my time here on campus and in this little corner of Texas, and we hope you have too. So that's all from me. Now it's your turn to go research more about Cardinal Nation. These students are incredible. This campus is beautiful. It truly is a remarkable university. Okay, everyone, take care and hope to see you on campus real soon. Cheers, everyone.